What's up guys? We're looking at one of my foot lockers here. And I restocked this thing with a lot of my collector's knives. I, I didn't think I could get this many in there, but I stacked them sideways. <laughs> so I just started lining them up sideways. I got I think there's around three rows or so, three tiers here, but I want to show you something here real quick. Let me get this. This is a Gerber. Patriot I wrap this is a vintage this is a early 90s one of them Gerber Patriot knives pretty cool knife and uh, I wrap this thing actually I'm probably gonna have to put a little bit of sticky glue under I think I'm gonna just take it back rewrap and just put a little bit of once that sticky glue, uh, glue drives it it'll clean off your handle if you ever want to take that this cord off this is number 12 bank line but this handle what it was is this handle was really slippery so I wrapped it with that number 12 bank line I got some number 12 bank line that I was wrapping my hollow handle survival knife handles with and so I just want to show you this thing has really got an outstanding grip now. Index is nice and it's it's textured, so it feels good and it does, it's not near as slippery. So that's something you can do, even if you got a solid handle knife like this. This particular model, the Patriot, that handle was just like I said, it was very slippery, and so I just wrapped it with that bank line, and it, and it looks pretty cool too as well. So just an idea. I did several of my knives like that. But just thought, thought I'd do this quick video. I was pretty proud how I got them all in here. Just stacked in there like sardines. Alright guys, appreciate you stopping by. And uh, so I'll let you know, I'll have some more videos coming up. Probably going to start posting a few more somewhere around March 1st. And uh, start getting back into some of this knife making and and reviews and stuff like that. I've just kind of taken a break from it for the, from this winter, for you know, during this winter. So I'll catch you guys uh, down the road.